Welcome back to the Fire Dead. It's Pokemon Vanguard. Uh, it's been a while since I've played this game. I've been binge playing Pokemon Z, but in the last episode, I don't even remember. But I believe we stopped here for a reason. We're gonna head south. I believe we have to go here somewhere. Let's actually check our quests real quick. Quests. Okay. In there. Let's see, let's see. I'm sure I think this is the way to go. Think? The right way. I think. I think. Maybe not. Ooh, shiny stuff. Nice. as hell. I honestly do not remember where to go. One sec. Alright. So, sorry for the such the random quick cut, but I figured out where to go. So, we are going to go this way. Excuse me. Rude tree vent. Heal up. Whoop. Okay. All right, all right. Let's head back to the academy and submit our work to the guild the administration. Hello. Oh, Marlin. All right, I'll be right there. Sorry, guys. My uncle wants me to meet with me. He says it's super important, so I gotta go like now. <laughs> Wait, but what about our work? Just submit our work first. We'll be right back soon. Come on, Fire. Let's head to Arlen. Uh, okay. Let's go. So, I don't know if you guys have watched more and more recent Pokemon Z uh, video, but I actually got a new job. So, the story with this channel is going to be up in the air. I don't know where I'm going to go with this. I don't know what the plan is. I am th thinking about something. Arlen Pokemon Center. Okay. 
Come right here. How are you both doing? It's been at least a couple weeks since I last saw either of you. Been well. Hopefully by next week we'll be enrolled in Zika's guild. That's good to hear. How is my mother? I haven't heard anything about her. I'm sorry. But about why I called you here. After the rangers finished searching her house, they gave me a list of things I could come retrieve that I guess weren't valuable to the investigation. I was able to get away with some snooping around, and I found something I guess they weren't able to. Hidden under the floorboards of her bedroom were a box full of legal documents. I'll admit, I was too, I was too, was very skeptical about the whole Amelia family thing you asked me to help investigate. But it's birth certificate. Actually, I'll let you read it. March 8th, 1983 AI. Destiny Marie Amelia. I don't believe it. Fire, you are right about that guy. My last name isn't Rosaria like my mother, but Amelia. That must mean my father was also still a part of that family. I really wish I could have met him before he... You should look at this as well. Just fake funeral papers for my father. What does that mean your father could still be alive? But I don't understand. They do not know about any of this. It's a long story, but after our parents passed away, Jackie disappeared from my life for a few years. The next time I saw her, she had an almost two year old daughter. She told me that the father passed away and didn't leave her with very much. So she returned to Osea. After everything she had gone through, I didn't want to bother pressing her for more information. I helped her get a job at a researcher's office, and for the next 14 years, everything was normal. No, I didn't know anything about this. I'm just so lost on why she would lie to me for so long. Was it to protect me? If so, then from what? There's one more document of importance, but I must warn you, it gave me chills when I first saw it. Their hospital papers. Destiny Marie Amir, diagnosed at birth. Full body paralysis? Wait, this makes no sense. How could I have something like that? I remember mom complaining about how hyper I was at the age of three. They all say the same thing too. Failure to cure. Failure to treat properly. None of this makes any sense. If I could just ask her about it, God, that would be, would be so much easier. But why did she keep this all from me? Did she think I wouldn't find out sooner or later? God damn it, Mom. God damn it, you. Destiny, there may be one place you can obtain answers from. My personal research on the Amelia family didn't yield many results. However, I was able to borrow access into their restricted section of the region's online library. There is a place in Southeast Ayura that is linked to the Amaria family. It is hidden behind a cave on Route 8. I'm going there. I have to. And I'm going with you. Really? You will? Of course. Then we have to go southeast, like, right now. Wait, shouldn't we tell Zeke and Calvin first? We have to travel to the southeast anyways to get to the Zika Guild. Yeah, that probably would be a good idea. But, Uncle Alf, thank you so much for telling me all this. I'm sort of surprised you've taken this so well. I guess you've really grown up, huh? But I'll let you two get going. Just be safe out there. Was this really the best place to meet? Not like it matters. Oh, trust me. After everything you've done, it matters. The hell do you want, Sonia? You've compromised two of our outposts in Southwest and over half of our grunts have either been apprehended or worse. Since when have you cared about grunts? Since I'm the one who has to recruit them. At this point, we have to properly abandon all operations in Southwest. Oh yes, that was the plan, wasn't it? And where the hell do you think you have the authority to tell me what I've done wrong? They'll have to put you under my command, remember? Yes, with specific orders to make sure that you don't screw up. Well, congratulations on completing your assignment, because I didn't screw up. Can you go one moment without being a 
Yeah. <laughs> if you want me to tell Delta to drop you from my command, I'll gladly do so. Trust me, I'd rather not have this entire organization fall apart. Great. Then let's get the hell out of here. Oh, and by the way, who the hell is fire? A piece to my puzzle. Ooh. What do you mean you want to leave now? Yeah, to be honest with you, I kind of want to relax a bit more before heading off to the southeast. You have all the time in the world to relax when we get there, but I need to go now. What could possibly be this important? I would love to explain it on the train, so we don't waste any more time. Come on, you gotta convince us first. For once I'm with Calvin, I kind of want a reason for why we need to leave early. Fine, I'll explain it, but you better be listening. Damn Maria, family. Sounds like a load of bullshit. That's what I said too. But my uncle showed me all the legal documents and hospital bills. I promise everything I'm saying is the truth. Hey, we don't think you're lying. It's just weird. But sure, I'll go with you guys early. Really? I'll come too, if this turns out to be true. I guess it'll be pretty cool. Yay! <laughs> that sounds like my girlfriend whenever she gets excited. Yay! Let's go catch the train to the southeast. Where do we gotta go? We gotta go to Orlan Station. No, we don't. I was going the right way. Oh, come on. I messed up. Wait, no. Gotta be straight with you guys, this game is entertaining, but honestly, uh, Pokemon Z, much more entertaining, honestly, if I have to be honest. From B. 
being honest with y'all. Hold on, guys. I know where to go. This way. Alright, I have a few questions. Your mother dated or married someone's family, gave birth to you, and then just left? Maybe your dad was an asshole. Zeke? Yeah, I'm sure you'll know what that's like. What do you... Th what you think you can go around saying shit like that? Like what I said. Was any less uncalled for. Guys, guys, it's fine. Never met my father. So to me, you're just insulting a stranger. But about your question, Kelly. You can't make much sense of it either. I just really want answers. More than anything right now. Well, I'm sure we'll get them. But for now, damn, who's hungry? We still have an hour before we get to the southeast. Let's eat something. Yeah, all this thinking has made me hungry too. Barry, you coming? No thanks. I'm not hungry. Alright, shoot yourself. Oh, I dropped the glass. Excuse me, are you alright? Keep calm, make no sudden movements. This train has been hijacked. The perpetrators are holding victim hostage in the cars up ahead. You're a train. Please, do something. The train's been hijacked. Oh my, thank you for your system. I'll be on my way now. Uh, I'll tell the others. Oh no, they can handle themselves, especially all together. I need to do my job as a Pokemon trainer and go ahead on my own. Hello. Huh? I thought I told out a hack to make sure the trainers stay on on the trainers on board stay out of this. Ooh, that's not a good lead for me. Let's go! 
That's fine. Locked. Fighting. Fighting. That's fine. That is fine. The job was supposed to be easy. When they're training on board, when is anything going to be easy? That's fine. Where the bad, where the bad trainer is on the twain? Ew. You dead? Keep going.
Time. And I think that's a good spot to wrap up this episode. In the next episode, we'll continue the train investigation, hopefully stop it, and hopefully get to our destination with no issues. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and feel free to leave any comments in the comment section. With that being all said, I'll see you guys in the next episode.